Portsmouth is the UK's only island city. With an enviable location on the Solent, one of the busiest waterways in Europe, the city of Sherlock Holmes and Charles Dickens, Portsmouth is a city with a big welcome and a growing university attracting students from all over the world. Portsmouth is a city with ambition. A large part of this future is its growth as a visitor destination, and this is linked to its developing creative industry sector. Part of the city regeneration plans is the landmark development of the Hot Wall site, restoring disused military barracks set in a dramatic waterfront setting and creating 13 artist studio spaces and a Delhi-style eatery. The scheme was to develop a dedicated artistic and cultural centre and secure a sustainable future for this historic monument. Turning the vision into reality was enabled in July 2019 by capital funding of £1.9 million, which was supported by many partners including the Coastal Communities Fund, Partnership for Urban South Hampshire and Portsmouth City Council itself. Portsmouth has a thriving creative sector, but there is a lack of affordable available premises for creative businesses in the city. The council is keen for creative industries, graduates and new startup businesses to stay in Portsmouth and to create employment whilst enhancing the city's visitor offer through regeneration of its historic sites. Collaboration over a five-year period made this project into a reality. Initial concept ideas developed with University of Portsmouth architecture students and the Creative Industries Department informed the Coastal Communities bid along with advice from Historic England a specialist conservation architect was appointed to undertake the painstaking work of transforming the historic monument into an inspiring creative space. The design approach was to strike a balance between modernisation for contemporary use and sympathetic restoration of the historic fabric of the building. The results of the design have been dramatic, as Contemporary Studios allows the public to see the artists at work and the adjacent open courtyard settles the development comfortably and quietly within the local environment. The conversion of this historic site has been challenging with its heritage conservation. The location to the sea and proximity of residents, but its unique nature has made it all the more special to work in and to visit. Well, the great thing is it's an affordable studio, which Portsmouth was really in need of for artists to grow their business and raise their profile. And it's also very visible. I think previous to the hot walls being here, there wasn't enough provided for artists and they're very hidden and very inaccessible. Whereas here, it's, we're encouraged to be open all the time and people can visit, which is um, really great. That's been a really important part of being here actually is how my profile's been raised and grown because it's much more visible. It's a very positive response from the public. Last year I had work that I made also in the Hot Walls sent out to Inc Miami which is one of the largest art fairs in the world. So that's very exciting to think that I'm making work here in Portsmouth and then shipping it out to America where it's sold and then hangs on walls in different countries. We have a bright future for the city's creative community. This heritage conservation has provided a new tourism destination, creating 2,220 square metres of new public realm, an extra 130,000 visitors, increasing secondary spend for existing businesses, 15 creative businesses that have supported 29 jobs plus four new apprenticeships, and the community are continuing to be involved in shaping its development. This is a new chapter for the historic area. It will continue to provide a catalyst for economic growth and future enjoyment for residents and visitors for the foreseeable future.